First time outside for a non-medical appointment. Going to the diner. Quit looking at my butt. It is week three post-surgery and it is a beautiful Friday. It's a nor'easter. I feel like one of everyone's favorite things is to be like, a nor'easter is coming. I am feeling pretty good. Oh God, I look very tired. Week three is a lot of muscle atrophy. Like my thigh is getting really bone thin, which is not the look. I, I like to have, a, you know, thick thighs. And sorry, I haven't had coffee yet. Uh, stitches are out or like whatever sort of I, I wouldn't look at it because I'm so squeamish. Oh, here comes Augie with coffee. He brought me coffee in this snowstorm. Can you believe it? I'm reading this book about houseplants and I'm gonna try this massager thing that I got. I'm very excited. So, you know, things are moving along. Okay, diva, 55 degrees and counting. Hope to get up to 60 tomorrow. I'm on my way to get um, my stitches cut out, basically. I don't know how that, that's gonna work. Center, but it just so I'm here with Lori, who is an icon and a legend, of course. Thus far, I'm yes. your favorite patient, correct? You are my favorite patient, okay? And you're my favorite too. Oh, I'm so glad. Best PA ever. <laughs> I have been trying to find ways to stay mentally engaged, so I. I, I've never sat down so much in my life, truly. It's rather boring. I find it's really difficult for me to engage in like chit chat on the internet and stuff. I'm telling the same story one million times and I feel like it's just like, hi, would you like to relive your trauma? Sure, here, here goes. I appreciate everyone's concern and I just sound like an asshole. It's tough to talk about it all the time and to be asked about it all the time. Sometimes I, I just put my phone on mute and enjoy watching my space opera on TV. <laughs> I'm really enjoying doing this vlog, but I feel like we need to come up with some sort of games or something because I don't know what to talk about anymore. Boop. 